Hello everyone, welcome to lesson 38, grade 8 mathematics. In this video, I'm going to explain to you, or I'm going to introduce the topic of algebra. The learners with the study guide, please go to page 27, or we are, I will be working on page 27. Alright, now, this topic is very important. It's very, very important that you understand. Alright? So, what I'm going to do, I'll try my best to explain to you all these terms. Constant, a coefficient, a variable, a term, and an expression. Okay, now, there's one thing that I want you to understand from, from onset or from the beginning. So, if I have this, that's x. We like using x in mathematics, x and y, alright? So, that is an expression that is a term that is a variable all right but the moment i do this for x i am multiplying four with x i don't want to write it like this four times x so instead we just write it like four x so it, but we simply mean four times x so this, that is still a term, okay? It's still an expression, okay? So it's one term. It's an expression with one term, all right? Now, this x, we call that a variable. Mm -hmm. We call that a variable. And the number in front here, we call that a coefficient. So here, do we have a coefficient? Yes, we have a coefficient. There's an invisible one here. Okay, so there's a coefficient of invisible one. So again, 4x is an expression with one term. Okay, so this is one term, an expression. Is there any variable in this expression? Yes, that's a variable. And is there a, con a coefficient? Yes, 4 is a coefficient. But what is a constant? Okay, let me help you understand what is a constant. Okay, I have this expression, 5 times x plus y minus 6. This is an expression made up of 1, 2, 3 terms. So there are 3 terms in that expression, term 1, term 2, term 3. Now, as you can see, addition subtraction they separate the terms so this term is separated from this term by that this term is separated from six by that sign okay so there are three terms okay so it's an expression with three terms are there any variables yes x and y are variables are there co any coefficients yes five and one are the coefficients are there any constants Yes, a constant is a term without a variable. Please, I'm, I'm repeat, I'll repeat myself. A constant is a term without the letters. That is what we call a constant. So, in this expression, we have three terms, okay? There are two variables, x and y. There's, there are two coefficients, 5 and 1. This one constant negative six. My friends, I hope you are following and this is making sense to you. Let me give you another one. I have three B minus seven X. Sorry for that. Let me just um, fix it. Uh, minus plus five, sorry, plus X. Okay. It's an expression. Okay, I understand from English, your, ex your expressions are things like, uh, I'm going to town, I'm going to write an exam. Okay, those are expressions. But in mathematics, this is our expressions. Okay, so it's, a, it, it's just a, a letters and numbers um, added together or multiplied together. Okay, but the moment I say 3b minus 7x plus 5 plus x is equal to 10, it's no longer an expression, it becomes an equation. Okay, so in the videos to come, 
we are going to talk about equations okay so now this is my expression how many terms are there expression how many terms are there one two three four this expression is made up of four terms are there any variables in this expression yes b x and x so when you write down your answer if, if i say write down the x the variables in this you just say it's b and x so you're gonna have to say b x and x all right because this is x this x is the same as that one all right okay are there any coefficient yes the three is a coefficient because it's in front of the letter negative seven and uh positive one those are the coefficients positive three negative seven positive one all right are there any constant yes five is a constant because this term does not have a variable and if a term does not have a variable it is called a constant i hope that is making sense to you so i'll repeat i'll, I'll, re I'll just recap if I, I i give you the homework so an expression is uh, made up of terms and a term is made up of variables coefficient or sometimes it just a number or it, it, it is just made up of a number without a variable and we call that a constant all right an expression made up of terms a term is made up of variables and coefficient a variable and a coefficient and sometimes if there's no variable in the term then we call it a constant okay i hope that is making sense and you have learned something okay now your homework please remember take write down your work take a picture and share with me so this is your homework all right so number one eight plus six x so please write down how many terms are there write down the variables and the coefficient and the constants number two four times w plus nine times j minus p plus four write down the number of terms the number of variables no right okay how many terms are there of course the number of terms write down the variables write down the coefficients and the constants okay you do the same thing to number three thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye bye